PCIe 7.0 was just announced. And it's going to be a fast one, ladies and gentlemen. Although PCIe 5 is just starting to trickle out into the real world, the fine folks over at PCI SIG have unveiled the specs for the PCIe 7.0 standard. It's fast. It'll do 512 gigabytes per second. (laughs) Eight times the speed of PCIe 5.0. Really? Two times what PCIe 6 will bring. So PCIe 6 is quadrupling speed instead of doubling? This is madness. Of course, 512 gigabytes a second will be for 16x connectors, and in real life, the performance won't be that high. But what that means is a single PCIe 7.0 lane will give us the same bandwidth as a full-blown PCIe Gen 4 16x slot. Wow. PCIe 5.0 SSDs are just starting to come out with speeds of 13 gigabytes a second, so maybe over 100 gigabytes a second could actually happen on a single SSD. I mean, NAND flash is going to have to come a long way before we're going to see anything like that. But who knows? Man, yeah. Anthony writes, if you could get an external GPU adapter like the Beast NVMe thing to work with PCIe Gen 7, that'd be hilarious. You could run like a full fat desktop GPU, full speed on your laptop storage slot. Or if we saw, you know, a Steam Deck of the future with PCIe Gen I mean, even Gen 5 or Gen 6 by that point, I worry that these generations of PCIe are not even really going to make their way into the consumer space, though. A, we don't need it. Honestly, we we really don't need it. And B, I have to imagine that the power requirements just wouldn't make sense, particularly for mobile. I mean, yeah, Moore's Law, blah, blah. We're going to see more refined process node technology but you got to remember guys as we get more power efficient like gen 4 controllers are also going to get more power efficient so it might just not make any sense i mean we've already seen multiple mobile platforms not carry the same pci express generation compatibility as their desktop counterparts from and like AMD. W- one of the things too is like by the time we might need it say we go like far enough out in the future and something crazy requires that type of stuff uh there's probably going to be gen whatever the heck way beyond what we're currently at so yeah i I suspect the consumer space will skip quite a few gremlin injector says linus this will improve efficiency imagine a cpu that only needs four pcie lanes i mean i guess we'll see We'll see. That's a good comment, actually. Are you better off with more lower power lanes or fewer higher power lanes? Will consumers revolt when Intel, an Intel or an AMD, releases a platform that has fewer lanes than the previous one? Because so far, that hasn't been the trend. I don't know. Thanks for watching, and thanks to XSplit for sponsoring this week's clips. XSplit is perfect for content creators or businesses, and you can save 10% off with code LINUS using the link in the video description.